Hey guys, it's Sejal. I'm recovering from a fever and my uh, gala is a little bit bad. So I can hear this very weird voice in my head. So if you can hear it, you guys know what this video is about. To be very honest, I uh, didn't, didn't think that I'd ever have to make such a video on my channel. Because you guys have seen for a long time, I've always tried to keep it more about the happy parts of my life like whatever stuff i'm making it's been more about that my relationship with mohawk was also one of those things which i was very very happy to talk and share about and um yeah i never thought i'd be one of those people who would have to announce uh, their breakup or end of a relationship on a youtube video i never thought that that'll happen to me but yes uh, mohawk and i have broken up now it's been about say five months or maybe almost six months since we broke up it's been a while now when we were dating you know a lot of people did ask me that yo what will happen when you guys break up abhi to channel everything is going hunky dory you guys look like couple goals what what will you do when you do break up and every time that that thought came into my head I would always think that you know I wouldn't say anything about it I know there'll be some questions but then after the point people would stop asking about it but it's been six months and uh, without fail on every video or every photo of mine and Mohawks on his Instagram you guys have so many questions oh my god I have never experienced anything like this I don't know where all this started from which is crazy because I guess because he stopped appearing in my videos which I get I'm not stupid and you guys are not stupid <laughs> so you picked up on the pattern um, but yeah it's pretty intense I never ever thought that I would experience anything like this and um, there have been fights in the comment section and some nasty things has, have been said about him uh, on my page and about me on his page so I thought that I should talk about it here finally and after that break that I took just to reevaluate whatever's happening on my channel and I went through like a, a couple months that were really tough for me I made a decision to be a little more honest and do more videos like these on Mondays where I actually talk about things that I've been going through and just be a real person you know everything isn't always perfect and I want to get that image off of social media as well even when I started my channel we didn't consciously think about Acha, okay, we're gonna tell my viewers that we're in a relationship. It just happened very organically in one video. We met in college and uh, Mohak helped me out a lot with my videos and I'm eternally, eternally grateful to him for that. Everything that I have um, right now with regard to my channel and so many other things, I owe so much of that to his help and you know just him being there to push me up he was one of those first few people that i met who was so supportive of what i was doing in terms of youtube i had what 300 subscribers when we first met you know the kind of people who just push you up he did not know about what i was doing at all i in fact told him what the full form of diy is and regardless of that you know he really gave me that push and that confidence in myself because at that point in time nobody really gave me that of course i had my mom dad um my best friends who were always there for me but then this push that i really needed and that validation that i needed from someone who i thought was very cool and it really really helped me uh, get out of my comfort zone you know and all the help that he's given me with my channel i'm eternally grateful and there's nothing um that can substitute that we were together for what three and a half years almost and um yeah we met when i was 20 and by the end of it you know we kind of realized that we're both headed in very different directions i'm doing this crazy youtube career he wants to go ahead and do his mba and um, probably move abroad and pursue his own dreams so we have two completely different paths and 
I think it was um, a good decision and we decided to part ways and hopefully like we'll do really really well in our respective fields and also after the point that when you have different goals and when you have different ideas about life there are differences that pop up and there, um, there are differences in opinion and how you should lead your life so all those things just added up and we thought that we should probably give being um, separate a shot and uh, it's been six months now and um, to be honest, I think this was the change that I needed. After the point, um, I felt, you know, that I was dependent on the relationship and I wasn't really living life as my own individual self. And in the last three, four months, uh, to be specific, I've really started to, um, you know, just live life on my own, explore myself as an individual and just be happy uh, being alone uh, going to cafes alone um uh, meeting my old friends that i hadn't met so many of my old friends in the longest time and you know reconnecting with all the people that i lost touch with and just being just being everyone bro you know being my own person and it's just giving me a lot of positive energy and that's a change that i really needed I had a really really good time with Mohan so and all the videos that we made on the channel were really fun too. Um, we made some really crazy stupid videos on this channel and I'm super happy for all those experiences you know and I'm not the kind of person to delete old photos or delete old videos. I'm very proud of whatever we've done and uh, the coolest part was that we did it like a team for the longest time. We were partners and we really cherish like being a team. That whole buddy relationship, that whole friendship that we had was 100% true and um, I'm so happy that I got that experience. You know I honestly believe that everybody who comes into your life uh, comes into your life at a particular time for a particular reason to add to your life um, to teach you something and um, yeah Mohawk for me um, it's the goal <laughs> and Mohawk for me was that person you know who gave me the confidence when I didn't have it so yeah thanks again man like if you're watching i'm gonna send a bouquet to your house and uh, throw a party when i hit a million <laughs> um yeah i really am so thankful and uh, another thing that i wanted to talk about is just moving on in general you know i've seen um girls um and boys girls a little more than boys get a lot of flack for dating too many boys or just moving on too quickly from a relationship. Um, girls are called sluts, they're slut shamed, oh no, ye to, to hai. Itte sare ladko ke ghum hai. and all of that. And I just wanted to, you know, put it out there that um, that's not something you should do, especially on social media. I wouldn't do that to anybody. And it's perfectly fine to acknowledge the fact that, you know, something good happened and some things work out, some things don't work out. And like I said, everything in life teaches you something and it happens at the right time for a reason. So, yeah, please don't give me or Moha too much flack for uh, not being together. I really, really thank you guys for giving us such a fun experience supporting us through the comments you guys are pretty cool <laughs> all the videos that we've done together all the comments that you guys left were really really fun for us to read through and all the fan pages that were made about us we really had such a good time going through those and thank you so much for being there for us but also um yeah just realize that we're also real people just like you and um i wish then Mohawk also goes ahead and finds someone better than me in the future and I also go and find Brad Pitt or Shah Rukh Khan or whoever <laughs> and yeah and I hope you guys will respect that and not give us too much give us too much flack for it or just anybody else in general so that's what I wanted to say hope that clears out everything that's the big secret <laughs> out there now and also um just like i said in the beginning i'm gonna do a lot more of these very honest videos and i'm gonna make a series out of this share with you all my experiences with regard to mental health career and a slightly more honest very serious things that i do want to talk about and i'm thinking of a name for the series and you guys know how amazing i am that is my talent so i came up with 
say what, say gel. And um, I don't know, that's the best thing I could come up with. Let me know below if you think that's a cool name or if you have suggestions for a cooler name, let me know below as well. And thank you so much for listening and hopefully understanding. And yeah, I really appreciate you guys and I'm pretty sure Mohawk does too. And Mohawk, if you're watching, thank you so much for everything and you guys as well thank you so much for everything <laughs> bye i'll see you soon